much awaited news coming forth. BJP announces Suvendu Adhikari to be contesting from Nandigram against Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee in West Bengal. The big prestige battle between Mamta and Suvendu Adhikari has now been confirmed. BJP announces its candidate list for 57 seats in the first and second phase of polling has been announced. Amit Malviya joining us on the phone line. Mr. Malviya, here is an announcement by the BJP. Suvendu Adhikari to be fighting Mamta Banerjee in Nandigram. Your thoughts on that? Well, the BJP is going to win the seat and Mamta Banerjee will soon join the inglorious list of incumbent chief ministers to lose their own election. It seems like she's, she's challenged Suvendu Adhikari, given, given up her comfort seat of Bhavanipur and taken on Suvendu in his own turf. Don't you think the conviction speaks for anything here? Well, Mamta Banerjee is so nervous about contesting from Nandigram that she has got into a tacit alliance with the Abbas Front, which has not fielded a candidate from Nandigram. Clearly, Mamta Banerjee is eyeing the minority vote in the seat and hopes that it will see through. So she is not confident at all. She's nervous. She is not sure of winning her election. She is looking at Toligand as a second option after having deserted a traditional seat of Bhavanipur. Are these signs of an incumbent chief minister who is confident? Mr. Barbe, we see Mamta Banerjee hectically already preparing her ground there. You said uh, an alliance that apart. She is already finalized on a house in Nandigram constituency. She's going to be staying there, working out of there. So her entire focus is all pinned on Suendu Adhikari and ensuring his loss. Imagine if the chief minister of the state who has governed it for 10 years has to camp herself in one seat and not be camping around the state. It tells you that she's not even sure of winning her own seat. That is how unpopular she and her government have become. Do you feel, uh, Mr. Malviya, Suendu Adhikari is the fitted candidate to be fighting Mamta Banerjee, the chief minister of West Bengal, considering her power, her might, her strength? Uh, it, it appears the entire TMC will be rallying behind her to ensure her victory there. Well, it seems like Mamta Banerjee has overestimated her position in Nandigram and Suendu Adhikari will beat her to the contest. All right, this, is, this has been a unanimous decision there uh, from the BJP on several of the TMC members not getting tickets, several MLAs not being given tickets, claiming that they've been approached. They're approaching by the BJP, BJP is approaching them. They now find comfort in the BJP as they're upset. Would, would the BJP consider taking them, taking them in? <clears throat> All right, uh, we're going to patch back to Mr. Amit Mahalwaya there. He, uh, with conviction, says Suendu Adhikari is the man to take on Mamta Banerjee. Mamta Banerjee and Suendu Adhikari will be fighting each other in Nandi Gram. Let's quickly cut across to Tanushri, Tanushri for joining, uh, joining us there with more details on that. Tanushri, we're looking at the BJP announcing the first batch of candidates, the first and second phase of candidates already announced. And the biggest takeaway here is the Nandigram seat. Suendu Adhikari will be pitted against Mamta Banerjee, uh, the Chief Minister of West Bengal. It seems like the BJP's full focus is to ensure Mamta's loss here. Absolutely, uh, Nabila, and in fact, the much-awaited list for the candidates of West Bengal elections has been announced. Those 60 names were expected, but as of now, the Bharatiya Janata Party has announced 57 names for first, for phase one and two for the West Bengal elections. And as you rightly mentioned, the most interesting name out of this is the name of Shuvendu Adhikari, as we all expected from the seat of Nondigram. Now, Nondigram is one seat where Mamta Banerjee, the TMC Supremo and Chief Minister of West Bengal, has already announced she'll be contesting from that land. And uh, now BJP has announced Shubindu Adhikari. We have spoken to Mr. Adhikari. Mr. Adhikari has been saying that he's a that uh, Nondigram is his bastion. He has been winning the seat of Nondigram for the last few years. And now Mamta Banerjee uh, has been saying that uh, you know Nondigram is like my is, is like my uh, elder sister, and I'll be contesting from there. So yes, the most interesting seat uh, to look out for in this West Bengal election will be the seat of Nondigram, because on one hand. Uh, uh, you know, uh, Mamta Banerjee is going to do all she can to win uh, the seat of Nondigram. And on the other hand, right. Shubindu Adhikari, who called Nondigram his bastion, his turf, 
is going to do all it's, it's, it's uh, indeed you know, going to be uh, absolutely exciting and interesting to see what pans out uh, tanushree do stay with us i'm going to quickly cut across to dola sen joining us uh, tmc leader uh, Ms. Zola, do take us through your sentiments of the BJP now announcing Suendu Adhikari itself to be contesting, fighting Mamta Banerjee head on in uh, his home bastion. Mamta <laughs> Banerjee now will be moving to Nandigram, staying there. Her groundwork has begun. What's your thought? What do you want to know from me? What are your sentiments that Suendu Adhikari has announced in the BJP? No, no, no. से कोई किधर कैंडिडेट होगा वो तो बीजेपी तैयार करेंगे हमसे उससे कोई लेना देना नहीं जो कोई भी नंदीग्राम में खड़ा हो जाए बीजेपी की तरफ से शुभेंदु हो और हु वन एल्स वी डोंट बॉडर वो तो हमारा जुरिस्टिक्शन नहीं है वो हमारा प्रेरोगेटिव नहीं है वो हमारा कॉन्सर्न नहीं है बीजेपी एक पार्टी है वो किसी न किसी सीट पे किसी न किसी को जरूर कैंडिडेट करेंगे बहुत शुक्रिया थैंक यू वेरी मच मिस डोला सेन लेट मी कट अक्रॉस टू इंद्रजीत इंद्रजीत जॉइनिंग अस विद लॉकेट चैटर्जी फॉर मोर डिटेल्स इन गो ऑन इंद्रजीत अधिकारी मेदनीपुर का भूमिपुत्र है और नंदीग्राम का विधायक भी था तो शुभेंदु अधिकारी मेदनीपुर से है मेदनीपुर का जनता शुभेंदु दाको चाहते हैं हम लोग देखा कि बहुत सारा जनता ने शुभेंदु दाको इतने सारा रैली भी किया था हम लोग भी नंदीग्राम जाके शुभेंदु के साथ रैली किया था बहुत सारे लोग आए थे तो ममता बनर्जी तो भवानीपुर से लड़े थे अभी वो नंदीग्राम में चला गया हम लोग जानते हैं कि लोकसभा चुनाव में भवानीपुर में बहुत उनका वार्ड में भी बहुत कम वोट था बीजेपी का ज़्यादा वोट था तो वो चला गया है लेकिन हम लोग जानते हैं कि मेदनीपुर में शुभेंदु दाकी तरफ से तिरुवंदु दाको जनता ने वोट देगा चैलेंज एक्सेप्ट कर लिया हाँ हाँ एकदम एकदम जो भी चैलेंज करेंगे हम लोग कहेंगे खेला हो लेकिन हम लोग तो खेला खेला हो जो बोल बोलता है राजनीति में तो ये नहीं चलता है राजनीति में डेवलपमेंट चल चलता है लेकिन अगर उन, उन लोग बोलेंगे कि खेला हो हम लोग बोलेंगे सेकंड में जब रिजल्ट अनाउंसमेंट होगा तो, तो तब मैजिक होगा ओके तो आप सुन सकते हैं बीजेपी के सांसद लॉकेट चैटर्जी बीजेपी ऑफिस के बाहर बीजेपी के जो जितने भी कर्मियां हैं उन पर वर्कर्स हैं उनमें काफ़ी जोश है उत्साह उमंग है क्योंकि जिस सीट को लेके सबकी निगाहें थी और जिसको लेके बहुत अक्कलबाजी कुछ दिनों से चल रही थी कि क्या शुभेंदु अधिकारी लड़ेंगे क्या वो नहीं लड़ेंगे क्योंकि शुभेंदु अधिकारी ने खुद ये कहा था कि मुझे नंदीग्राम से लड़ना है लेकिन अगर पार्टी किसी और को भी वहाँ से कैंडिडेट बनाती है तो मैं पूरे दमखम के साथ उनको जिता के लाऊंगा और पचास हज़ार सीट के मार्जिन से ममता बनर्जी को हराऊंगा और आज ये जो बैटल रॉयल जिसे कहते हैं जो जंग मैदान जंग है उस पर उतर गए हैं उतर चुके हैं शुभेंदु अधिकारी वर्सेस ममता बनर्जी देखने को मिलेगा नंदीग्राम में कैमरा पर्सन श्याम सुंदर घोष के साथ इंद्रजीत आज तक कोलकाता All right, there you have it. Lokit Chatterjee, BJP leader, says that uh, she's happy. The BJP is now announcing the first set of candidates. Of course, Suendu Adhikari, the man who has quit from the TMC and joined the BJP, earlier known to be a close aide of Mamta Banerjee, has now taken on, will be taking on Mamta Banerjee in his own home turf. In Nandigram, the BJP is now fielding Suendu Adhikari. The announcement has come just about a few moments ago. BJP has said Suendu Adhikari will be fighting Mamta Banerjee in Nandigram. Nandigram, of course, is a very, very crucial constituency. Uh, it's both important for the TMC and now the BJP with uh, Suendu Adhikari joining the BJP. It's now also very important for the BJP. If at all they manage to defeat Mamta Banerjee, it's indeed a big win for the BJP at large. Uh, here we're looking at Mamta Banerjee also not hesitating to take on Suendu Adhikari in his own turf. But Mamta Banerjee clearly has quite some significance, prominence in the area of Nandigram. Undoubtedly, back in 2007, Mamta Banerjee had held a massive agitation there, a huge rally against the left government's land acquisition. At that point of time, huge support that she gained decimated the left front right uh, in those areas. And Mamta Banerjee's TMC came to power. Consequently, we had Suendu Adhikari who won the seat time and again. He was, of course, a very strong man in the TMC, considered to be Mamta Banerjee's right-hand or left-hand man, close aide that they called him. Suendu Adhikari has now very recently quit the TMC, citing several discrepancies, saying that uh, a leader is not given his or her worth in the TMC. It's again, uh, he accused TMC of family politics. Uh, of not uh, and of no development of law and order issues or eventually has jumped ships to the BJP and now he is fielded by the BJP also now 
in the same constituency from Nandigra. BJP has announced clearly just moments ago that Suendu Adhikari will be fighting Mamta Panerji in Nandigra. Let's take a listen now to what the BJP and the TMC said during their announcement for Nandigram just moments ago, cutting across. I am Nandigram se Sri Subendru Adhikari, who was in the TMC Sarkar, 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 Sri Subendru Adhikari. Well, there you have it. Uh, Mamta Banerjee just yesterday announced that she will be contesting from Nandigram. Today, the BJP has taken its turn to announce, without any further delay, has come out, come out to announce that Suendu Adhikari will be contesting Mamta Banerjee in Nandigram. Now, of course, Suendu Adhikari uh, also sees that he has immense amount of confidence and conviction. He said whether or not he gets a ticket from the BJP, he has already plotted a plan for Mamta's downfall. He said it openly, he said it categorically, and now the BJP, owing to the confidence that Suendu Adhikari has oozed time and again after he quit the TMC, it appears that the BJP has now honored him with that ticket to fight the very powerful right now, Mamta Banerjee, who is the Chief Minister of West Bengal. Here we're looking at Suendu Adhikari who will be pitted against Mamta Banerjee. It's a formal announcement that's come in from the BJP just moments ago. The BB BJP there has announced the first and second phase candidates for the upcoming West, Beng West Bengal polls. It's going to be conducted in eight phases. The West Bengal polls spanning out to at least close to a month, a little over than a month, from 27th of March all the way to April 29th. Uh, West Bengal elections will be carried out in eight phases. We're looking at Mamta Banerjee, who's already announced the list of candidates. Uh, 291 constituencies candidates was already announced by Mamta Banerjee. Also now, the BJP has only announced the first and second phase candidates. And in that, the most important highlight here is that Suendu Adhikari will be fighting Mamta Banerjee in Nandigram. It's, of course, a huge prestige battle. What happens if uh, Suendu Adhikari from the BJP now manages to defeat Mamta Banerjee in her own constituency? How would she... How would she face that defeat? Uh, of course, here we're looking at Suendu Adhikari taking on the Chief Minister of West Bengal. It would be possibly for the first time, never imagined, never forethought. But here's a challenge before him, a Herculean task. But undoubtedly, it seems like the BJP is throwing all their weight behind Suendu Adhikari. If at all, Suendu Adhikari wins against Mamta Banerjee in his home ground, home turf, he indeed solidifies his position in the BJP, could be even appear as the chief ministerial face for West Bengal. Of course, so far, the, uh, the Bengal unit of the BJP, neither the national unit of the BJP have so far announced a chief ministerial face for West Bengal. If at all, if at all, Suendu Adhikari manages to defeat Mamta Banerjee, will he emerge as the chief minister? <laughs> Jekono meeting at Ariye, a company Jekono Sitanto Gosona Kutepare, the Baratu Jorota Party Tanoi, Baratu Jorota Patiaka Sinkolita Party, Baratu Jorota Patiaka, Ulusasita Party, A Party Tekono Sobate Ariye Kekota Taraben, Ebabe Bola Jaina, Etai Abner Company Songi, Baratu Jorota Party Topa, Tabeami Abner Kacha Kota di Tepari, Nondigrame Manonia Daran. Hello everyone, this is Rahul Kamal here. Hope you enjoyed this video. For the latest news and analysis, like and subscribe the India Today YouTube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon to stay updated.